But even before this time in 2014, you knew that there were a group of people called junglers in this country. Kabrin Janin in 2014 song on Yalon Neko Kafodo Bijaka of me junglers. I have been hearing black, black, but not junglers. Meta Memuela, Wolem, black, black, Menuka Femfuludum, but what to Mandali junglers too. I don't know of junglers until recently. But a junglers too, or to Malon Funi Labangulating. Welcome back, Mr. Witness. Sir, Bismillah. Thank you very much. In um, Before the break, you were telling us how you were correcting some of the rights violations that were made. And in the Fonian Nimola, it are among Nakumofo, all of Indigo, it are Tanun Katakul Ferrek and Napuru, Nandatinado, Membekiri, Nupurka, Tobenyo, and Tembendi. By the Jame government, Mayalonko, Sabuta, Jamela Mansakunda, by reinstating some officers who were dismissed, and Nungadokon or Katakulkon, all of Indigo, Modul Murundin and Dugo, Mayalonko, by correct? Tonya, that's, that's correct. What am Tonya? You also told us about uh, instances where you offered uh, advice and contrary views to, for, for positions taken by Jaime to dismiss uh, certain officers. That is in several circumstances. I did not mention some of them, and I want, I want to believe that they are very key here. Uh, if you would allow me to mention, because my mind comes to reflect on them now. Yamabiji Hakilo Botol Lalembediam Kantumomen, Barinata Jacolu, Elakukuma at a Bakele Kulu Kono, between Nina Tasilo Soto Buldembe, Woldolu Fula Lekatu, Ilako, Akuma at the Kurunia. Could you go ahead? Uh, and, and let's make it short. Uh, we have uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Another instance is when he asked me to give him the names of all those who are serving at the uh, tourism industry, TDA. I prepared the list. I thought it was going to be a good news for me. They were about 124. Um, they were all dismissed. I found very uncomfortable. And this is something that I have to fight. But there are possible reinstatements. It has taken me over almost a month. To see him was the problem. I went to him. And I explained to him. Quite 75% of those that are dismissed were recruits. They were personally selected by me. They were deployed personally identified by me. Why I, I want to be involved in that case? I instructed the commander of the PIU then to provide me with names of officers that are very decent. And I completed drug free. I completed drug free. He conducted the selection. And I said before their deployment, I want to come and address them. Some of the members I discovered are not uh, decent. And they, I have reasons to believe that they, are, they take drugs. I said no way. Let everybody fall in here. And I was the one because I've been their commander. 
Katuntele vijenu, katuntele mwila kanti yote nubee kuna And I have interaction with several of them during their training Nubee karangula tumome na ninja male bee kuna nini menu kanyoje I always go to the training school to give them lectures Katunkata hawa karambu ngutule watu wa watu ke karandi also time in on human rights issues and, and investigative matters adunja maja man nakarandiro kake hadamaya nyanto kenya leti anen kulu men yalon ko wolemu e la do ko sambanyati so i have to go to him and then uh, um, appeal to him odalilo ya sabun kombat ngam muru ka ngata ya ngawasi aye that these officers are one of my best officers afayan ko nyindo ko lalu nyille ben na do ko lalu ko no me yalon ko beteata do ko to and then I've spent a lot on them. And on the pans, Jamal Kela Kuokono. For ten good months, you were on the training. Then we tell him for carry tang in be karandi kang. Because when I came in, I changed it to training syllabus from five five months to ten months. Katu birin na ta karandiro yiriko nyenga falin ne kabo carry lulu kata han for carry tang. So to me, it is very unfair at that time. Katu otembo nte fe ngaje ko ate tilin na. I know something must have happened. Ngalongo oto kule kela. But I always want to narrow it down to a particular person. Oto kukundi na ketangkala file kabebo nyoto hanifo katalong jumale fomu kukunguti. And this was, he never disclosed to me what had happened. But ya manai tandi na menke tade. That's why I made a global appeal. Wala na nata wasi bake. They were, they were, 121 of them were reinstated. Na ata mo keme mumuwa ni kilimo murundi nang. These are people who are under my, uh, um, my responsibility to promote. That means they are all less than chief inspector, chief inspector and below. Aka wayatara ulbe kabo chief inspector palaso to kata wayuduma ibewo makamu leto. When senior officers, three of them, it has to take a process. Puru menu la palaso mu palasi nyato ngoldi walu mo sababu four way koluta kabonyo to follow. The bottom line here is. You pleaded with Jame for their reinstatement. And he accepted. And he accepted. So in fact, in some instances, when people pleaded with him, he would accept. Well, I don't know because many people come here and say they they choose his bad mood or good mood. For me, the moment I you hit me, I will react. Lolo na tajiri ya muda yuko kalamu fula le bala na abe kamfari wala na juu be laringa la kulu boka ke kilindi. Barindi la karola. I don't look normally look at the condition in which I'm going to find him. Nde boka juu be mbata la nyama nyama. But my my interest is. Nde la hamu momenti. Make sure that my people are not unlawfully terminated. Kaje kwa mmenu bengkoto ikani ba i mmeni silo manta. But Mr. Witness, you would agree with me in that in spite of all this, human rights violations continue to happen even within the police under your watch. But I said that the son of mani nala ko hani kabi onya onya nya na ningkata kuli be kono. Eh hana madi nyanta tinyal ten ten tal kathedrong police wala marolo marolo kono police wala kono. Even if it happens, could you take that again? Uh, I'm not. I'm not saying because uh, uh, officers, when you when you, dip, you send officers out, you cannot monitor everything that they are doing because there are people responsible of their welfare and uh, and management. Nte be kantano la katu dole fanalu marata itelu Kenya ni la palasolu la anila doko Kenya. But but it was still within the knowledge of the management of the police that human rights violations were happening within the police but hanin gabi alonta police wala nyaton ko la bundato ko eh hanam di nyanta tinya be tentantan ka ke police kundato yes that's also why that leads me because when i assume office the first thing that i did is to create complaints uh, complaint this and this was there but i created human rights office Ha, wamu tu nyaldi. Barinte muru tana, mol kata wasi bunda lume na polis la karola ubijele. Barinte le nata bunda dada melundi meya longo, wole belo la hana maya nyanta tini alukuna. All public complaints are are filed in that office. Jama mol la wasi dalu beka safari office holdo. And then actions taken. Andu kana kule falambulandi anoma memu tonya fasa rangi. And principal among the human rights violations were unlawful detentions. Anu abe kono wale inhara mara ni nyanti tini ali nyindi wale ma member ma jamu ma bedi wale mnyindi ko. Kamolo muda kesi ndi la kilindali la tala. Yes, definitely unlawful detention is a violation.
Onyala kama umuta wanyama umu nyantati nyalti. And it used to happen in the police. Nwa delta leka ke polisi kundaro. I will, not, I will not dispute that fact. <coughs> <coughs> oh, that's, and, and, that, that, and, that's the and it create. used to happen under your watch. Uh, when I was the IG, but on the, not on directly under my watch because they have supervision. There are so they have supervisors at different locations. Ah, uh, IGT akaso akake barbitungolu imantarantela maroni ya maro koto ko ibente fongole koto ka anyanta kela nyamin ka belarin tela koto. But of course, Mr. Witness, you know that uh, that would not absolve you of responsibility. If it happened under your watch as IGP, you are responsible ultimately. Yalo nese do nyinkamal haninga bi o nyanya ya fo ya fo nyamendo we uda umasa buko ibe kwenye mbebole koto le katu nga itela mune mpolisi wala kundu nkwede wala haninga bi ibulo ba koto le in order to avoid that responsibility that was the reason why I created the human rights office for people to have chance to complain and matters to be looked after but when you are in the office, you are not in the office. 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 Yes, that may have been the case. You are not in the office. Uh, right, but what would have been more effective? I remember the office. I am uh, would be a position on your part that would prevent these rights violations from happening. Don't you think that is the case? Yes, I think it is the case. I think it is the case. I think it is the case. I think the best way to do is to, 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 to include human rights um, this thing in, the, in the curriculum. I think it is the case. Hadamaya alihakiru hadamaya nyantolu tu kumulundi ila kulu Kenya alukolo. But would it be more effective also to have standard operating procedures that would prevent rights violations from happening? Bara ya mrema mera fanangu sartol ni tamandri bulu bambandi ngole nyanya tarla kaitara lori nje mea alongo walebe bantam bila nying hadamaya nyanta tinyala mea alongo ebekiri nupuri kanake. Of course, I want to believe that if you look at the files, correspondence from the IGP's office to regional commissioners, you will see quite a number of um, warnings, um, memos, in respect of um, or detaining people for a longer duration than, duration than necessary. So, yeah, but in the case of the police, 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 the the police, for reasons of privacy. Uh, I would circulate it to the chair and uh, the deputy chair. This person was detained. You are aware of it? And uh, this person was unlawfully detained? Correct. Um, this, Don't mention the yeah, name. This person was detained. Okay. Just, just answer the questions. Yeah. Unlawfully. Well, I will not say unlawfully. Uh, in, excess, in, a, in excess of the statutorily allowed limit. Yes, that's true. And that's a violation of the person's rights. Mm. Let's be gen gender neutral here. Mm. Yes, definitely. It happened during your watch. Yes, it happened during my watch, but uh, just, I think I just if you it. also ask uh -huh. the person, uh -huh. the person will tell you what I've accorded. Yes, yes. I'm sure that the but Mr. Witness, you would accept. That, uh, I mean, at a particular level, uh, general courtesy would be accorded to, to one another. Basic courtesy would be accorded to one another. Yes, but it's very unusual 
for the IGP to come down and ruin everything. Yes, but that person. Pour IGP Fangoye Jinang, Kana, Wokolu Dolu Tamandi, Bundalula, Manyalon Kebelor. But what I'm trying to drive at here is that here was a blatant violation of a person's right, and the IGP was aware of it. President Debe Bundam and Noma Satakan, Noma Kan, Wolem Nindigo, Filang, Kofel, Misalf, Mofil, and Mealonko, Ia Mutaya, Sindu Black Lial, and Yantotina, and Member Maraling or Cordal, Member IGP, Aya Kalamutale. And the IGP did not do anything to stop or to end the violation of the right. And the IGP, ni memo police or law, kundo ko de okorda ni gona yamang kukata kuwa kata kuge puruka jeko omari ni na nyanto ni na tinya puruka dangala. True or false? Let's start from there. Tonya fofania. Yes, I did not do much to get up, get the person out. Because I was only asked to take custody of her. Let me join the neutral. But, but, but this is precisely the point. This is another violation of rights. You are not, as IGP, you are not just a custodian of people mm -hmm. for the head of state to come and say, keep this person for me. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not like being a <coughs> hatsman and you are giving a cow to keep. The IGP is the inspector general of police and cannot act in that capacity for the president. You agree with that? Cut. Kake IGP, the police on the Nyatron, go to Keno and Ninti, or Yetaro Dingiran in the Bilamete Alango, President Binala Mona Tako, and Yimuta Jalias in the Yam. Amanke Kuokata on Yam, Eterno IG, the police on the Kundon Koti. Amanke Nisikora, the Bialanko, Buffalo, Moena Rako, and Ninisota Yamuta Yam, Onyam, Kuokata on Yam. Probably um, things are not going that way, the way it should have be, gone, but then at the level of me personally, this is not the only. Situation. There are a lot of situations. Let, let, let's focus, let's focus on this one first. Uh, uh, I have an important reason for bringing these things out. Yes. Authority is not to be abused. No. Authority is not to be abused. Authority is to be exercised in accordance with law and it has to be exercised judiciously. You agree with that? Yes. And it, it was a blatant violation of rights. It was also abuse of authority for the president just to show, keep this person for me here. That is blatant violation of rights, you would agree. I will agree that that's, 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 that's the violation of rights. Uh, uh, you, you would also agree that it ought not to have happened. Yes. Ah. You would agree with me that in a democracy, the IGP should have said, Mr. President, you are asking me to violate this person's rights. And under the Constitution, I am obliged to protect this person's rights. Mr. President, you in a democracy, this is what ought to have happened. Democracy, I cannot remember exactly the facts of Council, that matter. Yeah, hold on a second. Council, um, uh, there is um, a lot of exchange going on between the two of you in the abstract. Can we see the system <laughs> that? Uh, <laughs> so we, we um, yes. the students would be in the picture. Yes, thank, thank you, Mr. <laughs> Chair, for that. I am a Tandija Wolem Indigo, Nimari in the Yantonia and Yana Tankandila. In a democracy. In a democracy. democracy. That's, that's right. I, I personally made several efforts. Tonya Balindafango Kung, Kataku Jamal Leke. If I remember, I think this is about um, 
Um, don't tax. give us the facts. Yeah. Don't give us the facts because okay. it will disclose the person's yeah. name. So I met, I, I, I approached the, I went to the AGIS chambers. This was in the form of a white paper. And the, the, white paper was, the white paper was sent to AGIS chambers. And the review. And then flared and the instruction comes. I made several attempts. I have a personal relationship with the person. But it's not because of my relationship with, with, with the person. But I'm not going to tell you that I made that move. The that I made that move. Pour que au silo l'utamande. The person is my blood cousin. Car tu ou mari monte fango sana ou kono toilet. So I made several efforts. Na kata kujama leke akoto. That does not change the fact that the person's rights were violated. Kani kabi onya onya umani kuni falinde. The moment you are detained more than necessary, your rights have been violated. Well, Mr. Mr. Witness, it's not being detained beyond more than necessary. It's being detained more than the allowed limits on the law. Right? Yes. I bring these things out to show that public officers are not required to implement unlawful orders, irrespective of where they come from. That's right. And you should not have done it even though the orders came from the president. Do you agree with that? Uh, I, I always, as I said, I, I know you'd made efforts, but let's yes. put aside the efforts. The bottom line is, it should not have happened. That I agree. Uh, to me, to me, Witness, to me, if we, if we follow that, you would see that there was an animal farm. Uh, wherein some people received better treatment than others. Depending on their status in society and personal relationships with the officers entrusted with their care. Which by itself is still bad because it's discrimination. Uh, look, I, I qualify Mr. my last statement by telling you Mr. that uh, I, I did not do it because I'm related to the person. Okay. And ah. that's why I, I went further to tell you several other people that I don't even know. Uh, I agree with that. Uh, and understand the objective here. Our mantra here is never again shall these things happen in our country. Uh, our president is a public officer whose primary responsibility is to uphold the constitution. And to ensure that those officers under him also respect and uphold the constitution.
So we are doing this exercise so that all of us would learn from the mistakes of the past. <laughs> you would agree with that? Yes, of course. Okay. And therefore, what would you advise the Inspector General of Police if the President were to give him or her, whosoever IGP is, if the President were to give him or her an unlawful order? President President I don't think what had happened will ever, never, will ever happen in this country. Mr. Mr. Witness, you have not answered my question. Yes, I will, I will, I will continue. My advice to the IGP that nobody should give instructions or they should not accept any instruction for anybody that violates the right of Thank you very much, Mr. Witness. Mm -hmm. Let's now move on uh, to the issue of uh, the Ghanaians. Uh, you returned to Gambia in 2007. Not to interrupt, but uh, before we leave the last um, issue, can the witnesses mention a list um, that he gave to Jame of uh, 124 individuals, I believe he said in the tourist um, uh, sector. In the tourist sector. Yeah, I mean, he, 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 that's the third reference he's made to a list that he had given to Jame. Can he include in what you requested them uh, by Wednesday to that give letter. us copies of um, uh, those um, uh, lists? Correspondence. And uh, if, we, if we can do it in writing to him, so he would not, um, uh, I believe he would deliver, but uh, to be sure that uh, we requested um, uh, those things for our own records as well. Legal counsel in Karo, Kaito Mename Alonko, Udokula Mumu and in Nano Tobe Daming, many Alonko, Kobe Dukola Nunto, Lunta Latin in Madinkira Leto, a Fancio Tolu Soto Wire, a Kaito Dolby Lemon Lakmo for Tabari, Nin Tolu Besar in Kaito Memphan Balafasi or Fanal Lafaji, Purin Kamala, Ibesi Duna said they are Kaito Lukonon Sulata Menulaja. I'm not sure whether that document may be available at the headquarters but what I know is that the list was submitted to me by their commander and then it was General Baji that he sent and I had delivered that list to him. Among All the officers are still, quite a number of them are alive and I, um, I even met one of them part, being part of the officers here just a uh, few minutes ago he, he came to greet me you know, so uh, the officers are 124, but 121 are reinstated. Yes, the yeah. three others are not. I'm not sure whether the, the list, because the list was submitted to me, and it was in a hurry, and I gave it to General Baji and I gave it to him. But I know their the dismissal reads all their names. Probably you will, you will, you will see that, let, that we can get that from the headquarters. The list that are submitted may not be available because I want to believe that I don't make copy of that. But the, his reaction to the dismissal, that is obvious that it should be available at the police headquarters. Well, listo, what to be kaito membala among coin ma fabetal la police corda bato saying. Katunin kamala bring kaito nyin nata and yamoto nata and cane. Adum brafta tamantefana nata o kaito le chikanga di general bajila. Between ye kolu tambin di ye tentendi wole nyama. But between hanimbi, a nalonko tolu menia lonko is a feta wanya womumuang anin nano. A tolu as a keno yetara a police la corda bato la kitabo lubala. Katu inata mumuang anin killing ube murundi la palaso lutole. Okay, as I said, that was the third list that you referred to. If we can get the others as well. Okay, I will, I will find out. I will, I will find out from the from the headquarters. So being, it should be filed there. I don't. Uh, the file that I receive, including their name that I sent, probably may not be available. But the, his response 
to dismiss them may be available in the we, office. We will um, provide you um, the request in writing so you know exactly what we are looking for from your testimony here. But, um, thank you very much. Um, uh, Council, you may continue. Uh, thank you very much, Mr. Chair. Uh, Mr. Witness, you did say that you became CMC in 2009. Right, that's correct. Get a CMC 2009. Uh, I want to believe you are mistaken. Uh, take a look at this document. Uh, it is uh, dated uh, 1999. Then it should be late 2008. Ah, near you be 2008 bandula ma fangoleti. Let's say that as per this letter, silanga fuko kasujini ni letter rokang. A joint, a task force was established. Inata na kafu lo ni mianango kafu 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 jamal mol doku bunda jamal mol le yole lo bole nyokang. By Gambia government. Mianango me olundi wala Gambia masa kundari. And a support team to the tax force. Uh, to deal with the UN AU delegation that was to come to Gambia to investigate the issue of the West African migrants who were killed in this country. Yes. Yes. Ha. And uh, this letter is dated 4th September 2008. Correct? Tonya. Correct. And ah. in the letter, you are included as a member of the task for support team. You are number two, number three rather on the support team list. And you are listed as crime management coordinator. So by this it means, therefore, that before September 4th, 2008, you were already CMC. CMC. Yeah. You agree with that? Yes, yeah, I agree with that. And so That's good. And by this letter, it shows that the government took the visit of this delegation very seriously. Just looking at the task force that were set up, so that the government included very high profile people I in the in the in the task force i mo 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 balle dabula nyi kafo nyi ngon menu nyanda e dabula nyi kafo ke kis kis ro nyi kono could you read out the membership nyi kafo nyi mol membe ma bore nyi ma be nyi tol kono e karanya ba i did not see counselor i did not see this letter you did never, not see it before i've never seen this letter nyi letter ne na ma teje all that i know is that i'm instructed that I am selected and I should be there. I am not surprised that you did not see it. I did not see it. I did not see it. I am not surprised that you did not see it. Because the letter would have been addressed, at least the one that went to the police would have been addressed to the IGP. As a general letter on your mentor, the police or the Yaton police or Yemenki police or Yoki Yoki police or the Yaton Kole, Mem IGP. Do you agree? For your son, Nolan. But it's copied to IGP. Precisely my point. And it would be for the IGP to instruct you. And it was the IGP who instructed you. He called me that I should be part of that task force. And I should report to the ministry on a particular date. Do you have any reason 
to doubt the authenticity of this letter we dalilo dalia soto puruka hakil fulo soto ni letter ola be ku sahaare ala kuma kan sahaare ngol men beje ba well since i am part of it and is 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 very clear and i also uh, form part of the task force i have no reason to 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 disbelieve ah uh, why re kulem me yalon ko afota aketa andun tarta ka foko no woto dalila tembulu men sil lara baliala Could you read out the names of the members of the task force? Menu ben ka fonyi ngono e tolu foisi ilang di banke no nyala ba. The composition of the task force, the composition of the task force is as follows. Menu bi je wolam nyiliti. Secretary General Office of the President. Secretary General President la office auto. Secretary of State for Interior. Secretary of State mem marta banko kan ku nyala wolam siran tiyoti ka fonyi ngono. Secretary of State for Justice. Secretary of State mem marta tilimune kitolla. Secretary of State for Foreign Affairs. Secretary of State mem ben ni bantala banko lu tema. Inspector General of Police. Police wala kuntong ko. Director General of the NIA. Director General ulam NIA ngko la nyato ko. Defense staff. Mem fanamu nyato ko ti sojaro la karola. Support team. Ma ko rilalu. Malamin Sise. Malamin Sise. Numo kujabi. Numo kujabi. Yankuba Sonko. Yankuba Sonko. Ali Jaba. Ali Jabang Ibrahim Madrame Ibrahim Madrame Assis Haidara Aning Assis Haidara Good and our ba Aning our ba okay. uh, Mr Chair we asked to put this letter in evidence it should be exhibit 27 exhibit 207 request granted council thank you very much baraba uh, Mr. Witness, uh, before you return, yes, you want to say something. Um, I'm not sure whether I'm the right person to tender this particular document. Ah, among whom I'm for until the moment I'm not going to be able to do the job. Because I've never seen this document. Kato ni kato until the nyama maji. Even though I believe in his genuine, his genuinity. Anila tala kuni muku soto ringoleti. But um, it's still not been to me. It's not been tendered to me. But until a mirror to a man young client to put it, if it is the procedure, I wouldn't mind also. But in other words, I'm not a killer. I'm not a fanatic. I'm not a killer. 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 I'm not a Omar the document tendered. Ani ngokai to la farra ci re jarul ko. Thank you. Inu mara council. But uh, the commission of inquiry is the master of his own procedures. Ka to kisikisir commandiro atamando wolam kulu be nyato ko. So that answered your question. Thank you. We na nyin karo jabile. I am happy with the fact that you have raised this issue. Nyin keta nyi se wote pour nyin ko wulindi. But the mere fact that you are comfortable with the document ari ka fuko wayri kayto nyin ala ko a meede un ay ay sondo mo tenkundile and the fact that there is no reason to doubt its authenticity alun dalilati je mensi akendi yesika kayto nyin na sahabal yala is in for good reason why we should put it in ko dalilo lem dalila kendo ti wala na wayri ila ta ala ko kayti sahari ngolom nsa dundino and this also saves time alu be wato fana be mako ila nga wato so because if we were to call a witness before you just to put in this document a lot of time would have been wasted but jamal have tambila it's good that we save time that's right and i say this also because law students are watching and they would want to ask the question why are we putting this document in when it's not going through the right person abe tata pour nga pour que ten cadre talibolu men be loi krankan wul fanal be lamoy kanne be jube rola Nyimbe mfanalu mako ila le puri isalo memu tarambuloti. Thank you very much. Uh, but you also worked with those people who are on the list. Bari da fanan ni o mo ki mo kilmo le dogo kel menu to be en kaito bala. Um the 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 task force members I think uh, it's only the, the the briefing that some of them I cannot remember but I know quite a senior officials were on the task force briefing and then the, um, the rest were the tech, uh, support team. Mila tala ko menu be kafoni mfanko no menu mukundo nkoluti kacha ni kete le puka kulo boi nyoto bari wakola fana wamakwe kafoni tebe menu kono delfana na tala loitele kom. So during this period you you worked with those 
members of the support team on the new water in kono in 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 kawe de mar lal kafu mwoli ali alini edu kokele hade before you returned to gambia in 2007 jandi be seyda nan gambia banko kan 2007 sango kono did you hear about the killing of Ghanaians and West African migrants in the country. For ye faro mo ele menketa ba nying Ghanian no la anin nying na ing Africa tili jinda la bangu dingo dolu mo. Of course, that was in the public domain. Ah, wo keta kule ti me ya longo amanun da oda. I I read lot of newspapers on that issue. Na kibar kai ti jamal le karang menu tili nta okuala. Why is in UK? Why atarambe United Kingdom banku kan? When I came back, green side ita nam fanang. Nobody talked about it. Mo ma akuma funye. But, but what was it that was in the public domain? But it's like when we when we go out in the middle of the day, I'm under a mule kumpo kona baby. Ansula, I will not say exactly what it. But my perception is that migrants were killed and they were eight in number. Nte a phone la ko ko ni mu kulang kena marimuli. But we don't ni nata londa ko ya udai la lumuta jana mo sainyo yemenu fa. But it was also in the public domain that, that over more than eight West African migrants were killed. In fact, 56 West African migrants. Yes, that was also in the public domain. In fact, I have here a press statement by the current president of Ghana. Uh, this was a press release. Kibar Kaito Soraja Mialon Kabota, Ghanaian Nolan signed President Mialon Kabota. The first bullet point in the, in, the, in the press statement is that about 56 West Africans, comprising about 42 Ghanaians, 10 Nigerians, 2 Senegalese, etc., were killed in the Gambia. Kwa hini mwole lelifa gambia banko kanjia mkibaru kwenye ya fe wole nyama, ayayayay, follow wole nyama. I have no information of that. Wole wu kibaru mantara mamo soto mu. But, but you know that gambia government was in denial. Ye ilo na kwa gambia masa kunda mbe nujanu ibe balandi nga kuwala nu. Yes. Ha. And it was denying that, uh, more than eight people were killed in the Gambia. And then you know, the government, more than a million people died. And then most of the Gambia banko kanja. Yeah, that denial I'm aware. Ha, well, ilawo balango kawo kumoso sombota ukalamale. The government was also in denial about responsibility for the eight who were killed. And on Gambia, most of the government people who died. And then you know, the government, you manke, mankang, do not the most of the million people in Gambia banko kanja. In Ghana town. Ghana town started to come. I have no information to that regard. The government denied that those people were killed by government security forces. I only know about the, 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 the circumstances which when you went through with uh, Madam Nsise yesterday, to me, it's, it's just a cover-up, but I only knew about that, the number and then their response to that, that uh, allegation. And also immediately after the 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 the, the new uh, the, the the departure of uh, the former president, I ordered to the CDS for the arrest of some junglers. When those junglers were escorted to me to to this to the CMC. Rio Jongla Solo Nati CMC. Intermittently, I pop into CMC's office to find out what, what the details. What in what in found Kata CMC Kata Prunsa Long Munkul Betama Kanje Nyame? I remember um, the, um, the tall guy from Tujereng. Nakilo Baka Unkejangonyi member to Tujereng Jata. Was telling the rest of the people to tell the truth. 
Bafo kandoli yanko puru isi wakili yeto nyafo. And he led my officers to identify all that are responsible of different crimes. Alu atele tambita na nyato kulalu nyato puru kaita ni menu barata mena meye menke puru kebe obonyo. That's the only time that I know great lot of things has happened. Tumole nata buwa kalama kukuja ma leketa nyimbangu. I look at them as if they are not human beings. Nke jubele konyilu abeko leko imanke hada madingoluti. When they started narrating, I moved out because I could not take it. Biri ya damu taka sata ya menke mbuka tano. I only asked the CMC to bring, at the end of the day, to bring the report to me. Nke nyilu fo CMC ya niye bandi lao kolubela asikibaro nyimbuntung. And he has done that. I have the copy of that here. And you want to share that with us? He didn't left out all of that. Mr. Chair, this is an interim report on missing persons. Mr. Minister. And could you tell us who prepared the report? We saw for the Jumaat and report on Yendada. And to whom it was sent? Well, it is signed on behalf of panelists by Chief Superintendent of Police, Fakir Badabo. And the mayor signed panel on Toyala, William Chief Superintendent of Police, Fakir Badabo. Well, I signed it Toyala. To whom was it addressed? Yeah, I requested for it. To, okay. All right, you, but you would agree it's not on a letterhead, so... No, but I requested for it. All right, yeah, because I, I, I do not continue listening to... Some of this is very, very uh, okay. shocking, and I said, let them, let them um, give me the uh, listing. Because these are, this is from people who have done those atrocities, mm -hmm. and they are still, they are not that much remorseful in the way they talk. Katu bring Iba Satala, Mukala Muno, Alaola Nankafindi, Katu Nilbeni Santa Kantu Omena, Abele Koi Man Nimis Akwala, your Woko, Nino Jibe, Akaduntela, the Wala Akendi Mukapare Purkan Lamuela Kola, but in Telanga Kani, Puria Yinki Barodin. Mr. Chair, if this document is accepted, it should be Exhibit 207A. Kiama. Ninga ada reason dan ni letter orang ini kaitu orang ini report orang ini dunda abe kela sedia roll demi alangku abe kela ni muro mendo alang tuo eight. But when did you order this investigations? Wadai cuma letek kamu di purun ini kisikisi roh eke. It should be immediately af maybe maybe fakir bawa saya sign the date the date. Asike drone watu mengkaitu dengan. To look at the last page. Fakir bawa ala sign roh be demi ni kaiti labang jube. Proyes alumni silang. Did he state the date? Twenty two March, two thousand and seventeen. March karotil mua niung flow two thousand and seventeen. This is three months post jame. Karisa wakola jame boeringola. The investigations was on for that up to that point. Sikisro bekeri na nung hanu for tempo. Just immediately after Jamme's departure, that I instructed I. Jamme bought a jam water. Because my fear at that time is that quite a number of them will leave the jurisdiction if they are not controlled. Jamme bought a jam wrong. I can go to the police and kiss kiss road. Damuta. Katu lata ni lako ni mat kuotari andi ka damuta. Na du kundi ta wrong. Jamme better leko no ibe borla puka bonyi mbangoka. And you did well. You have to be commended for taking that initiative. Thank you very much. But that also does not change the fact that these violations should not have been allowed to happen in the first place. Of course not. And that these junglers were known to us before the fall of Jame. You agree? I don't think I know. I can only say I know one jungula. And I come to know him when he came to my office. And who, who is that one? When did he come to your office? Um, I don't remember vividly, but that was my first contact with the uh, jungler. 
Why did he come to you? He came and he said he has an accident with his vehicle. And the vehicle is badly damaged. He has been going up and down to traffic. And nothing happens. So I decided to call the commissioner Fadia. And inquire about the, past, the, the accident. Then Fadia told me that the file is almost ready. Did he ever come to your office about the case of the Ghanaians? No. no. He came when I, I instructed Fadia to make sure that the matter is put before the court. Okay. Let, let us move on. Those details are not, they are not really very important. No, it's very important. Okay, uh, something ahead. happened after that. Okay, what's so, and and it's also important that the commission knows what happened thereafter. I, after two weeks, he came to my office to thank me. That he is compensated about 250,000 for the for the for the direct vehicle. Why I want to mention this thing? Sometime in 2015, 14 or 15. What is it on 2014 or 2015? I was coming from my house in Jabang. That's why I'm building. Still building it. I, I was driving a Pajero. Although the number is not IGP one. IGP one today. I changed my number please to different regions. Because the fact that my vehicle is is well known, IGP one, you know IGP is here. So I applied for about seven number plates of all the regions. So I was coming from my house, just quite far from the estate junction. Just around 10 o'clock. I saw about six people. Dressed in civil, my uniform there. But um, I can see a rifle by their sides. I decided <laughs> to link onto the two because two are two on this one side and four on the other side. Katu ngani muta puru kanyati limufulo la katu mufula be karadola mo nani be karadola. I lowered my front glass. Ngana moto nyato we ro njindi. And somebody in the mask said, Oga, move, 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 move. To me, the person doesn't want the rest of the people to know it's me. Because I'm not used to him, I don't know the voice. But I managed to drive, and then after some distance, I put off my lights, and I was going into until somewhere around. I was going to Sukota, but I, I ended up. Uh, pulling out around uh, all you do. I was a little bit panicked. I was panicked. But I stayed, uh, uh, I comport myself to off my lights and then drive in the dark. Only the, 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 the the small lights were on. Then I had my own thinking. I thought that if I was going to be a little bit he was moving out, my okay. only who is presently with me here, Came into my office. He said, Do you know this man? He's one of the jungles. I said, He is a jungler. I, I think what I, what I did is good too. Because he came to complain and I refer him to traffic and I, I think he's going to be looked after. I want to believe that this is the person who was telling me to 
quickly because I did a favor to him, I did a favor for him. I'm not sure, but I, I want to believe that he's the person. This is why I have never seen them before. You see, you see, all these, you when you saw them at the CMC's office, you wondered whether these were human beings. Yeah. CMC office or I have a more than what they were doing. So even these seemingly evil people can sometimes extend courtesy and 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 uh, and and and, and uh, Save kindness life. Save to, life. to people. Ha! How many in Satan you molo? What on you what? If an alka had a maya kulu ke moli yenne. And uh, when you ask them, they will tell you, "I'm a good man." Ask <laughs> this person, I have done this help for him. But even before this time in 2014, you knew that there were a group of people called junglers in this country. Kabrin Janin in 2014 song on junglers. I have been hearing black black, but not junglers. Meta memoela wolem black black. Menu ka fin fungulu dum, but what mum mandali junglers tola. Because when 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 I came from UK. Uh, one of my officers who was with a PIU officer before and transferred to the state house. Uh, the solo jiba. I think uh, I was told that he's black black. I was told that he's black black. Yes. But I, I don't know of junglers until recently but the jungle store was to ma lon nun fuñi la bangla teng mike mike as recent as 2014 for 2014 what on ko no yalo ah wo ma fangla lo but it was known that these black black were committing crimes but i lon dal ko ñing fem fin dun na lika be bara jawul kele i know i don't know of the crime that they committed at mm -hmm. that time until it's disclosed to me but i know they are very rough they are, they have series of encounters with my officers at checkpoints most of the time officers at checkpoint will come and they say these people just bang on their uh, their, their their signboard and then drove off when you call when you call the the, 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 the the army because I always tell the, the the commissioners to talk to the operation commander of the police who will talk to the operation commander of the, the army but they always say they are they, they are not under our control. Ninko police la operation commander ye diamo sojaro la operation commander ye ni o commandiro ke wati wati ulufanal kafale ko ni lumantara ntella maro koto de so that's how they are yeah. umu ulube wole nyama nung did they ever tell you under whose control they were inana kafu ene be juma la maro they always say state house but i want to believe that they are directly under general baji and the former president and you know not by uh, destroying uh, the equipment you have on your checkpoints they would have destroyed government property of course, some, sometimes they don't even only stop in that, they open fire. That is for possible for sure. Because they, when they know that, because sometimes when they, they are dealing in drugs and they check, they reach the checkpoint, they will always open fire so that the police will find back and they will run. Because we, that's our belief that, you know, they are onto drug peddling.
kadu nyimolo kalango siata hani drog sira fenja wolu kata mandila dun ni be sila fason kan ifudata na molu malanya to hana bu kada nyina ko lanya nyin taki wala kati nya e kakido gondi ka fay pour nyin kamala wayri ka nyimmi ko na molu be bulale no male ke bayindi o dalilo le ya sabu e kawo ke pour ka borieta all three examples you have given are violations of the law e misal sabol men be di jaw misal le de yalon ko be mulu wala luati nya of course Have you ever caused these things to be investigated? And prosecuted? Nana ina na fero landi le bampuru njing lai baro njimpuru ki 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 si anung ki ki tinda kang. Council, I did not. Council mau ke? Why? Ne asabu mau ke? You try to find out under whose command they are. You find it very tough to know who who they are. So they are all there. I know they should be under the command of the the CDS. But if the CDS because The, as the IG, if you want to investigate anything, you have to uh, let the CDS know and release that person to come. But if the CDS is saying they are not under my command, uh, difficult to know. Aka kolea le puruka ni mola kwa no masara. Katu tumodo luninga kala kumani roke. Puruka fanya mola lafta le puruka ije wala ke ilondi silo kang. Fereti je fanga akumu futa ni sidi es ma memu la kundongodi. Ni sidi es fanga lora kafuko ni lumanta rante la kanga kutoi manta rante na maro kuto silang ibe kuitili na jumale la. Awole kuhulu kule yani. For me, those that are under my command. Tela karola menu bengkato menu bengkato. If there is any problem, I'll get them. Kule yako soto nta dau da nke soto le. Were you afraid? to investigate the state guards for the violations they have committed not just of the law but against your own people oy sila tala bang pour ka state guard ol nyin ke la kol kisi kisi hana man ke nyin de pour lo ala karo kam non bari ida fa wala do kulala tanko kam i will not say i am afraid nda fa la ko sila tala de what i want to believe is that left ala la men wala nyin diko i I don't think I can. Mamira utumo nsa keno wonya. Why? If you want to wage a battle that you know you are going to lose. Ni lefta kele wulindi la ite menganyela. There is no need for you to wage that war. Uto amanjare yo kelo damuta. So you 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 pretty much. It is certain to me that if I request any of them. Akweta ma utumo lew koni nga kanindiro kensula tak kiliwo kilina ikono. I may ask likely. Replace them. But as a Kenyan, we believe that Ali, 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 Ibondi, Ali, Alamari, Josai. You are afraid for your own self. Not not only for my own self, because I will give directives as the as the as the Inspector General of Police. Among the people, but my directives are going to be carried by some people. But in the Kamu di la menu la umu lubita o Kamu Taman. And I don't want to subject those people to those type of um, harassment. Andu mbao kama dila menu la menu ba no masata la malafi woleta du mantoro kono ni bulata ni mola kono. It was certain to me that they will not win that war. Katoa kweta maleko ni ngamu luki menu be bulale la kono. I have situations. I have situations. Why do you describe it as a war? I think I'm just using that war this thing because I'm just saying you cannot. If you know that you are not going to win a war, why wage a war? ล่ะดันยินแล้วก็ยับยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยูยู
the challenge involved and the difficulty involved in you doing your job during that time what wala kwa ya kwa mi alongo wale ba ko ko nyi ngono ibo le itandika njang wo what wala yes that's that's right umuto nyaldi and in fact ngabi <coughs> ah you did not do your job in that regard because you needed to preserve yourself and also the safe your own safety and security and that of your men emira do ko ko anyante ma nyame nyin kamala ko ilafte fane tankandi anira do ko dal fana yes uh, my my concentration is more on my men barinta kilo belori men kan kende kende ke wala mun na moluti if you hit my men also i, re, I, I react katu nen na molu ma do rong fanam bu katu no je woni fanga i would mind going home I would not mind going home for that. Mam 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 is better not to than to go and then and 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 get your people involved in a lot of things that you cannot get them out of from. Nde I can I can nyin ti nde fango kuma e boje. Hanni be mbayla wala fisa nyi ngam mo dolu dundi kole ya kono nte bondi no la dame. For me the issue here the prunte ko mo menti jang is more about the environment the status quo that existed at the time wo wato la ko la nyaabe no nyaame wala mo wala mo tala ko suulodi where we had entities and forces that we are not subjected to the law da mel di alango nga bundal so do ko bundal so mi alango wol buka luwani e buka ko ma fela definitely there are the, there are entities that are that are above the law at that time o tembo to nyala de bundal be keri men ya lonko wol be luwai santo la I personally had few of my officers detained at the NIA. Gatu nado kulal mo fula soton tay men muta case ndi NIA. One of them is a senior officer. Adun kilimbe ko no mo plastic ball ti nyaton kalem. Um he's a commissioner of police. Mo commissioner mo meul ti police. I have to go personally. Nda fanga le na ta ndi nda fanga pour kata ko kis kis. But what I was told is that they were investigating something. Ye muna fonye ko tel be kule kis kis kan. But they should have contacted me. Bari nyanta futalante male nu. and then asked me he said nyilinka then i if i want to hand over that person to them i can hand over that person to them. Well, i don't know of the circumstances no information no nothing and you pick them and and they are there with you ni ndenyan taw mari dile tel lanu mba dile la lenu tumbo natal wala nyanta kela bari kuma mam fonye imam bondi ku kalama imam saranna yewlu mutale a nyama do radi yate to le nyame this in the passing of um, uh, commissioner jata wala kata moti ka fo me commissioner jata and the, the 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 auto of that this thing uh, fakeba dabo and me may yo kaito sign we ka fo me fakeba dabo then fakeba was a superintendent to mo fakeba mo superintendent leti on a flensi report that was filed against him by another police officer and room police do kula do le fananata kuma kuma furi mo safia la koto do rom pro eh 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 nyanta mutala menka tell me mr witness sedo afonye Should a police complaint against a fellow policeman be a matter that should go to the NIA? Police or any police or a cousin of mine on go call and call and dam mal tema. I na na quota aya bole NIA for nyan laba. Amanya ngela. It's strong. Amang ke silot. In fact, that to me, NIA should not handle any uh, complaint. Nde fanga la mnya jeroto. NIA amanya na wasida. Womo wasida tala ukoldo. I was with the police when the SB, this special branch was on. Mbenun police bring ila bunda ka fo me special branch me ya lon ko ila do ko ba fay. Bo be ken. Ena e ya munta e tel mu chokin dan to special branch la Carola. Special branch never uh, um, operate like that. Special branch bu kela do ko ta mandi no nyama. Even among us we don't know some of them. Nan intel fo ngol ko no man do lu long ikono fang. They operate clandestinely. E kela do ko ta mandi e fay yenne. Their duty was only to rip file their report not to arrest and we tell lo ko munyeti ko nin ku keta ya safe yow ki baro na bar nin sembote bul pour ka momuta how this was changed mana along wo falinta nyadi le i want to also blame the law makers but he left a law da la le tout mila wa carola because they have gone to the extent of mandating given mandate to investigate to the nai kadu tata le hanu foy futata lo du lato pour ka kango anin sembodi nai e wala kis kis ro la carola from from the the, the dvi to act of parliament kabo e eh, bunda do la kata han fo debuté bu mo fongola so that's fashion abe abelare nu wala nyama uh, 
you would agree with me, you've mentioned earlier, that the investigations of the killing of the West African migrants was a government cover-up. Well, when facts are known now, it's a cover-up, definitely, by all circumstances. But even that time, when this task force was set up, it was known that it was a cover-up, especially within the circles of police. Probably it will be done by people who are here at the time and they know the facts. I don't know the facts. All the time, no. All the time no. is that some migrants are, were, were, were killed here. But the circumstances of their killing and, and, and the report that you read the last yesterday or just the day before yesterday, this was a big surprise because when you are going through the report, I was also watching and I, this is, is terrible. And but I had contact with this report in 2009. Okay. But, Mr. Witness, Zero. even those who participated in the earlier cover-up, we are part of your support team. I, I only know about that when when I, 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 when you read these things to, to me. I, I, know, I know they are part, all the people that I mentioned here are part of the task force. But when I look at the, this thing and I reflect on the membership. But I think I'm the only person who was not here at the time. Bring ya karanjan nem. Men men bebe task force ni kono ibijele. Bari bitun wairi otuma mantera banko kang. Bring a kuo wanyar chaten no nata along kony lata nyame ani menu ba kono. During these investigations, in kis kis zero ni watro ni kono. You had cause to ask for the diary. Eh, i ale watro zero lepuru kany diary ni ka kani. Bara. I want to make ratification on that. Left or There was no investigation as far as I'm concerned. My task is to make available certain documents to the to to to, to the, the UN team, the UN ECOWAS team. Facilitate, facilitate the conduct of their, their investigation. But at this time you knew that the Gambia government denied that more than eight Ghanaians were arrested in this country. Yes. As I said, I'm never aware of that. All I know is that I know, confirmed that eight f uh, migrants were killed here. The denial aspect of it, I'm not opportune to see that. Now, for co Tonya Lambota Kalamangani Mui, Quegan, Luntam Mosai Fajang, but the performance of Kundaya so solenu, a Mambo Kalamanu Tumo. Probably I was not here at the time. Sikio Tembo Mantra Bangkoka. But you did say earlier that you knew that the government denied. No, I said I knew that the, these Ghanaians were killed, and you went further to ask me whether I know the Ghanaians denied. I said I confirm that foreign nationals are killed here, and they are eight in number, but the denial of the government, that I don't know.
Nyam fajam koto nya mbota nyin kala mako lultan sai yowlu fa nyin banko kan janne son tawala bari ka foko man sakunda na tan loka ko moso so mawfonu well it is quite worrisome and shocking that you would be appointed uh, to this position and you did not even know what the government position was abe ko le ala bandani ko abe warla bage pour yitara nyin maka moto ka foko imalo ndu man sakunda lo la bulo menteni ko nyin kono which position are you referring to we the government accepted or denied I mean, which position, my current position or my previous position your previous position at yeah. the time as cmc as cmc appointed yeah. to this task force yeah. the government, government this is a policy matter and then i'm on a personal side you asked for the diary from bara Correct. I am to submit that to Who asked you to submit it to the UN? In no, it is said whatever they requested. That's what we should make available to them. Yes. Then I call back. But, but who asked you? to give them the diary jumale kanindro ke ye diary di membe bara na bara no because i i was the one coordinating and i have no specific instruction as to do this do this ndela be kolo kumben kal no bari mbanyi ya maro so to ka fonya ko inyante nyene kala be kala so you 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 believed that the diary from bara would be necessary correct yeah, yeah, because because I, I look at bara sulo uh, amnesty amnesty or uh, the martin keres report and he mentioned certain places and i requested those pl those 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 diaries nga wa martin kerry ala e diamo ko no ngaw ni ngaw moy ya e damen lu fo so ay din kiralu men lu fo da lu le ya sabu la ta la ko to din kiralu ni ngaw lu momo ku nyal ta tar la safere ni la ko to jele wala na ngaw dari lu kanin so did you who did you ask for the diary for for bara i tried to find out from bara station as to whether uh, the i tried to find out from bara station as to whether uh, the, the, uh, the diary of that deed is is available and uh, i was told i was referred to jawara demba then jawara demba said let me ask uh, babu kalba you know, i called babu kalba he came to my office uh, didn't you find it odd <laughs> that you would ask all these people and they would still continue to refer you to some other people eh mol men be kadin dangi tenten da ka fo ke ke hi sam ke sa unni sa ni do ni ni ga ni 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 ga ni ni ma man ta tumo men nga kanin duro folo mole la bir nga ko ni ni ka o tumo jawara demba e ko nga o ni ni ka nga jawara demba fana ni ni ka jawara demba fana ko nga babu kar ba ni ni ka bu tumo lem legal council kay fo ni tekle fe ka kooti puruka ibe saundin saundin ka foy kar nyinin ka kar nyinin ka kar nyinin ka of course ah what did it raise in your mind i mona we sabat ndi sondo mo no ko nyi what raised my why are they why they for me i think they are just shifting responsibilities to each other ndela mira roto amunta be do no nyin saundin saundin kan ka ka la nyo kan that's that's that, at that time o tembo but why well I, I may not know the reason at that time but now i know the reason uh, during that time you called ba what do you mean ba kumandila office kono and what was the conversation muna mun kacha adati na kacha da men ba came to my office and i asked him about the the the, the diary ba na tan na office nga nyinin ka diary la and he said sir this diary was requested by the honorable minister of interior some years ago ba ko nyi minister me marta banko kan ku nyalla wala nyi dari kan sanji danta commando and it should be with him ando nyanta tar law minister le bulu at this stage intendant what was your reason for wanting the bar the bar diary mo moy dali lo di no member sabu le be sulana no bar bar la diary la for me i think it's going to be it's, because it's mentioned i only rely on the, the, because the complaint must have been must have come from either Amnesty International or Martin Kerry.
So I went to the Martin Keris, um, this thing, um, 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 extract of his statement from the, the, the Amnesty International. But, but why was the diary relevant? I am sure I'm Martin sure, Keris sure. would not tell you about the diary in Bara. Why was the diary relevant? As far as you well, concerned, relevant because I thought at that time, don't I, overlap. Yes. I thought at that time this is going to be one of the issues that one of the this thing because if they are coming to investigate, it's it's obvious that they will read to all these places and or they request diaries of that. But my question really is, of all documents that can potentially be at the police station, why did you specifically request for the diary? I did not only request for the diary, I request for an investigation report on the matter. Man diary nyin dam man kaninde, hani kisi kisi kuo lumenu keta kuo nyinto, wo fanang akaito lunge kaninde. But, but, this still the question is, why would you want the diary to be brought? What is the specific significance of the diary? Because this is not recent diaries. And, and, if I allow the investors to come up to it on the ground, it may take a reasonable time because they, have, they, they, they are only here for, I don't know, four days. Yeah, but you, you're missing the point. The point is, what is the significance of the diary to this yeah, investigation? Yeah, because I, I have that belief that there are some, some of the activities concerning the missing persons will be in the diaries. Lata nyene la ko nyin kisi kisi rila la nata jang ni man dayari nyin kanin juna ni fu nata jang pur kana dayari kanin wano ta be melale adu nata la nyin fana na ko ni ngwa kolu be bulon la woto nyin mulu menu ye man ta teng aketa wato men wairi ila ko fulo ta bara la woto ila ko be terle safari ng bara la dayari le kono wala nan sula tao dayari la okay did you see the diary eventually? Yeah, the diary was produced and, and an extract was made for me for that period. The diary was produced and an extract was made for me for that Where is that extract? That, it was pre presented um, because I just want to, but if you want me to. Go know, ahead. Yes. What happened is that um, when Bar told me that uh, it's with the the Honorable Minister. I consulted the IG, IG IG. But we are together. I'm not quite sure who among us called the, the, the former minister. Could either myself or, 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 or Esa Baji. And his response is that you check with Numoku Jabi. Then that's how we stopped. Later on in the day, Munumo came and told me that um, did you, you asked the minister about the file, yes, about the diary. I said yes. Do you want to make extract? But I think it was in a safe custody with him. And he made extract for me. I kept that. That is just a, a day or two before the arrival of the team. And we were waiting for the telephone to be called. So I wanted to submit it on the on their very day. But they never requested for it. I kept it with me until finally when they completed their distance. And then I submitted it to them upon their request. Did the diary contain any information? 
the Good. diary from Bara. Uh, Did it contain any information about the West African migrants? Diary nying kono. For I fem fudi jela me along ko abesu juni nying nying Africa tili jinda la bangku dingo mola kuola ba. Me the activities that I thought would have been in that diary were not there. Until a mirror to nga mirror nung kulu menu nyanta terla wo diary kono imantaraji. So, so what did that? What information did you glean from that? What conclusion did you draw from that? Well, I don't know. If you don't know what has happened, it's going to be difficult, because to know whether this, it should, all these names or whatever should be there. Because I was not here. But all that I know is that from Martin's statement, he made mention of uh, Bara. Uh, well, That's why it is important they were arrested and taken to Bara police station. Wari watu mo mukuli tume mante tarajang. Watu mfana hakilo borta ni na kanga. Wari Martin la kumakanga luto. Aye nyumbu fakobiri ni muda i sambaba ra police korda luto. So wala nang hakilo yeye muda kwa nyanta tala wakaito kubuko kono le. Mr. Chair, perhaps this is a convenient time to stop for lunch break.